What's up guys, it's Chilantis, and I just wanted to do a little PvP log for you guys. It's like a vlog, but I'm PvPing while I'm talking about stuff. Uh, I'll just give you guys a quick video, because I actually did a uh, poll on Twitter asking you guys if you wanted to see a stream on time or a vlog, because I had a really late start today. And uh, surprisingly enough, you guys wanted to hear about uh, a YouTube video, so that's pretty cool. I'm using the Inward Lamp, which is a new scout rifle I got from Trials of Cyrus this weekend. Um, it fa fires super freaking fast. I got full auto on it too, which helps out. And it has hidden hands. So I can get target acquisition pretty easily. Um, but the problem with it is it takes forever to kill somebody. And this guy is going to come around and snipe me in the face. Because the guy, I don't know, man. It's just it's weird. I'm leaving. Um, you have 17 rounds, which seems like a lot. Yeah, but as soon as you like actually let go of this... Um, yeah, 45 damage per headshot. Shoots that fast. I'm already out of the clip. It's just, I don't know, man. I don't really like this gun too much. Oh, God. Whoop. I'm not a nice talker? Or I don't have Shade Step? Well, I just don't have Shade Step. Okay. I don't know what happened there. Try doing the old Shade Step escape a thing. Alright, I guess I need to push, like, circle four times now instead of two. That's weird. Alright, well... <laughs> Now that we know that, um, yeah, check out that time to kill, man. It takes forever. It's actually not that bad compared to pulse rifles, but pulse rifles offer a lot more consistent flinching, and um, you can get a lot of shots in one burst landing instead of having to consistently have your target on the person at all times. It's just pulse rifles such as Neverwinds Mercy are just better from my experience um, than this weapon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh my God. Took me like eight shots to kill that guy. Oh, I should not go in here. I don't know, dude. I don't know. Is this invisibility smoke? I don't know if I have invisibility smoke or what on. I'm gonna do this. See, that works out. I am in such a bad position. I'm just gonna leave. That's my plan. I'm gone. No, don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Ah! I made it. I made it. I'm alive. I'm alive. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm gone. Goodbye. You'll never see me. You'll never see me again. I'm gone forever. I'm gone forever. Goodbye. Woo. And turn around. Hey. And then they're going to think that that guy is me and it's the master plan. It's the master plan. Where did he go? Hey. And I win that trade. Ha 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 ha. Dude, Chase Step is like the greatest freaking perk of all time. I don't even understand like where it came from. As far as ideas go, but it's pretty awesome, man. Wow, that was terrible. Hopefully that helped. I don't know. Can I shoot this guy? Thank you. Thank you, Chad. You're welcome, Chad. We shot him. We shot the man. I heard a sunbreaker. That means we're all going to die, but maybe we can capture this in time. That'd be pretty cool. Ooh, maybe we can make it heavy in time. That'd be even cooler. <gasps> Blueberry, please. No! Why? Why? I don't have the grieving mode on. I think I have safe on. Nope, I'm a zombie. I'm a zombie. Definitely not grieving. Well, I guess kind of grieving. You're kind of dead. So, it's kind of a grief emote, but it's like a happy I'm dead emote. I don't know. It's weird. Michael Jackson, ladies and gentlemen. Um, but anyway, yeah, dude. Like, like last weekend was super fun. Oh, I might die here. Ooh, got him. Ooh, got him. Ooh, kill him. Um, but yeah, last weekend was super fun. I don't know, dude. It was like a Halloween party I went to. Um... Friday Night Stream was really freaking cool because I did like a bodiless gamer type deal. Um, I kind of walked into that willingly, which is kind of stupid. I understand that. I get it. Oh. Why did I just... Yo, I tried throwing a smoke, but maybe melee there. Did you see that? That was really weird. Um, that was really cool. Like, I pretty much did the entire stream as just floating around as a, like a bodiless head of a gamer. Which is a lot of fun. Um... And then later on, I actually look at that. Look how many times I shot that guy. He didn't die. Oh my god, dude. Um, later on, I turned into like something else, man. Can I throw my smoke grenade? Game, please. Please, game. I just want to throw a smoke there. I want to melee him, jump away, throw a smoke, blind him, and then like shadows, or, like shade step away. Like, it was the master plan, but this game doesn't offer any like abilities to like. Look at how long it takes to kill people! Oh my god, this gun's terrible. If you get this from Charles Osiris, don't worry about it, guys. Don't worry about it. 
<laughs> it's not very good. It takes forever to kill people. There's like no damage per shot. It's like a pea shooter scout rifle. If it exists, this is it. Oh god. And that was me jumping into a, sni a sniper line. Um, but yeah, later on the stream, I started putting my head on like Cookie Monster's body and like um, a cat and a bear body. It's like I just put my head on a bunch of bodies of like <laughs> images and basically turned into like having a costume of mini costumes. It was like it was super fun, man. It was the greatest costume I could ever think of. And that was in thanks to all of you guys' support on the stream over the past year. Um, and I just actually had like a like a donation goal is what they call them. Even though they're actually tips. It's weird, man. Twitch is weird. But um, because you guys reached that goal for me, like, I did it. It was a lot of fun. Why are you running from me? I can't kill you. <laughs> I don't know if you realize what gun I'm using, but it's not a dangerous one. Whoa! <laughs> Oh my god, I'm bad. Holy crap. Alright, um... Yeah, dude. I'm blaming most of this on the gun and the fact that I'm talking about stuff that's not PvP related while trying to do PvP stuff on a class I never play on PvP because I always play Gunslinger. But whatever, man. Also, first game of the day, also, um, my battery's dying. Because that totally affects, um, my PvP capabilities. Mm, my god, I killed that guy? Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't believe I actually got killed with this gun. Mm, I thought he'd miss me. I was like, oh my god, I am I hit a wall, and I just could have shade stepped left. I don't use shade step enough. I did some crazy jukes earlier in this video, but kind of lost track of it. But yeah, that stream was a lot of fun, so thank you guys. I really freaking appreciate all of your support over the year. Um with all of the streams and stuff like that it's been super fun and you guys are awesome and i just you're great i might die i died but he died too so suck it megaloth we traded kamikaze style remaining. um and then saturday i went to a bunch of friends houses and um actually did like a party stream kind of deal well we didn't stream destiny for once it was crazy and like we streamed like a game called stardust vanguard was like an 8-bit like gundam fighter thing as pvp and challenge modes and stuff that was super fun and we also played star wall which is like a weird arcade style like your space narwhals who have to like hit your horns into other like narwhals as hearts it was crazy it was a lot of fun it's in my past broadcast on twitch.tv slash just if you want to see um that gameplay also we played some shovel knight 2 which is a lot of fun too um so that was awesome we got to have a lot of friends on stream dav captain and trump well, I'm, I'm probably saying that name wrong because it's French and I'm not French. Um, nor do I speak it. And um, we had Pat Van, Cassifraz, Rai Rai Dingo, uh, Chandy Pants, and um, Fux McNoli on that stream. That was a lot of fun. So, it was great. Um, and then we went to do a party like at Halloween at that house after the stream ended. We played like Werewolf, which is a version of um, Mafia. I don't know if you ever played Mafia or heard of it. But it's basically the same thing as Mafia. Um, it's just called Werewolf instead. Dang, I missed that guy. I just want to. I just. I just want to do this. Okay, I'll take it, man. I missed, but I'm gonna go ahead and chalk it up to me not missing. How's that? Whoa, God! I'm like, I'm gone. I'm done. I'm not killing those guys at all. I'm just going to shade step over to more ammo and sight more kids. So it was a lot of fun, man. And we had like 16 people in the werewolf game too, which apparently, um, Trump, who's one of my mods, does a lot of D&D. &D. Um, he's like the, the, what's it called? The dungeon master for D&D &D stuff. Inbound. He's like really good at narrating games like that and just making control of like situations and talking about it and like. I don't know, man, but he goes to, like, certain conventions, and apparently has, like, a 64 version, or 64 man version of that game, which is insane, because, like, it was 16 people where he still felt like it was super, like, Clown Fiesta style of a game, but, um, I don't know, man. Did I get heavy? Oh my god, I got heavy. Let's go. Let's go. Kids are going to die. I almost got sniped in the face. Throw a grenade. Oh my god, did I just... What just happened? It feels... What feels like what happened was a rocket launcher shot and I destroyed the rocket with my grenade but then there's also an incendiary grenade that came 
But I think the rocket was actually incendiary grenade, and I just made it blow up. So I hurt myself with my own grenade, and an incendiary grenade blew up on me as well. And it was just me being sad. Um, but in any case, that was fun, man. If you haven't checked out... Got him. If you haven't checked out um, Werewolf or Mafia, you should definitely play it at the next party you go to. But yeah, and then yesterday I wanted to play Halo 5. But, um, yo, dude, that required a six-hour installation. My god, we did... I did not plan for a six-hour installation. I thought I could just get home and, like, boom, put in Halo 5, play Halo 5. That's not the case anymore. So, the Halo 5 gameplay is actually going to be happening on Wednesday instead. Still positive, even though I'm on the bottom of score charts. I kind of just, like, chilled a lot so I can talk to you guys. But, yeah, um, Halo 5 Wednesday is happening. That's on the 4th for the Halo 5 playthrough. And, uh... The 6th is a Black Ops 3, which you guys should definitely check that out on Twitch.tv slash Channelantis. Because I'll be doing a Black Ops 3 giveaway for you guys, as also thanks for supporting me all this time. I won't give back to you guys as well, but that's basically my vlog of a PvP log. I was super distracted the whole time. <laughs> I don't know if these are the best of ideas, but at least I'm pulling off positive KDs and winning in every single match so far that I've done these things. It's only my second one though, so we'll see how it goes next time. Until next time, citizens, thanks for watching.